This is a 2018 Harris Bruno XL Coat ZR30. Uh, UV, aqueous, and prep coater. It has a ton of different capabilities. Uh, we're going to talk about it for a minute. We are not going to run it today because we do not have the consumables and there's also no feeder with the system, which we will talk about next. So, like I said, there is no feeder with the system. It is set up with the transitioning unit, the coating unit, the curing unit, and the receding stack, pile, pile receding stacker over there. Um, so it is uh, <clears throat> as everything but the feeder. The feeder is not included because the company that had this, who purchased it new, had a specialized feeder for it, um, which they kept to feed a different machine in their facility. Uh, this actually didn't, this didn't work particularly well for their specific application with the specialty feeder. So the machine does not have a ton of usage on it. Um, it is a very good machine. It's just for their particular purpose. It did not work, work very well for them. So it does have low usage. Um, you can use a number of different aftermarket feeders, which would marry up to the unit right here. You can use like a bomb pile feeder or um, it really just any aftermarket feeder you can that you have already or you can purchase and put with this system. So uh, these are some of the spare parts and rollers here and hoses. Uh, this is your chemical tanks here. This is the transitioning unit going up into the coder there. Uh, this is your coder here. You can see the stainless rollers in there. This is the control panel touchscreen. It has a camera unit on the delivery, the uh, receding stacker delivery, so that you can see the paper coming out if there's any issues. Uh, I believe you can also, it also has cameras here, so you can see the sheet. So there's four cameras total. Uh, this part here will actually slide underneath here when installed. This is, we had a, this professionally palletized, so we did not want to depalletize it for the photos. But just so you understand, this part here will slide underneath that table, and the drying conveyor marries up with the roller, the coating roller right there. Uh, this is your curing unit. And then over here we have the receding pile stacker. Um, there's the infeed on the stacker there. You can just see from the condition of the rollers and the belts, like this thing is very little usage. This is your the other end of the stacker. Do a little shot around back. This thing was in production. Everything was fully functional on it. We just don't have the paper. We were considering setting up for a hand feed, but since we don't, I mean, so we don't have the material to run it, we decided to just do a walk around video kind of show you the unit, show how good a condition it's in. Um, I don't know if, if you're not familiar with UV coders, if you look underneath here, I mean, usually there's, you know, coating leaks and all kinds of things. You just see how clean this entire setup is right next to the coating setup, to the coating rollers, and it's just in fantastic condition. Here's the other end from the back. Again, this is a 2018 Harris Bruno Excel Coat ZR30. They're approximately $230,000 new. It's five years old, but it has very little usage as we, you saw in this video. If you have any questions, feel free to get a hold of our office. And again, this does not have a feeder, but any aftermarket feeder will work. You could also purchase a feeder through Harris and Bruno if you like. Um, there's a lot of options. Or you could set it up to feed directly from some sort of other machine go directly into it. Thank you.